2K Sports welcomes you to the following presentation of the NBA. Welcome to 2K Sports. We have the NBA coming up. Great to have you with us. Our broadcast team tonight, on one side, Greg Anthony. On the other side, Steve Smith. And on the sideline, David Aldridge. I'm Kevin Harlan. It's the Sacramento Kings facing the home team. So Sacramento will get the first possession. Let's take a look at our starters for Sacramento. Lucas is out there with Stojakovic. Then it's Richmond. Then there's Robertson. And it's Weber in at the five down low. Shots good by Stojakovic. And you have to admire Stojakovic's confidence. Sensational at knocking down those catch and shoots. Robertson with the steal. Pass to Stojakovic. The pass to Lucas. Launches a three. A prodigy with the rebound. Captain Clutch passes to the great one. And he jams it with authority. And can you always depend on him or what to lead you to the right place with that pass? Money. Now here's Robertson. He's covered closely. Pulls up on the wing. They get it back. And how you need to disrupt a smooth big man with some sick hands. And I like the fact that the defense is Shooting looking to protect the rim at all Chris costs. Weber. Two shots. And he makes both free throws. Because he knows he makes a living at the line, he invites contact and sometimes even initiates it. Captain Clutch passes to the prodigy. Puts it up from 12. Sacramento grabs the miss. Robertson outside. With the drive. Inside, Lucas. And Lucas slams it in. Lucas. The D just kind of stepping aside and letting him get to the rim. There's a reason, GA. The lead is what it is right now. It's a backbreaker for your defense, giving up easy buckets like that. And he likes to get in a rhythm early. Nice triple. Now here's Robertson. Tight defense on him. Wasted no time on that one. In the painted area, it's where Robertson can destroy you. He's just too strong and too skilled. Here's the great one. Defended by Stojakovic. Here's the beast. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. First personal foul. First team foul. At the line for your home team, number four. And that one misses. You see? That's off as well, so he misses both. Captain Clutch grabs the miss, and here's the fast break. Here's the beast and the powerful one-handed slam. Playing with high energy, outworking the defense up to floor. And I just love it when the fast break results in a high percentage look. Not always the case these days. Now here's Robertson. Lucas, that's good. Jerry Lucas. And how about the vision there from the big O guys? Beautiful. Lucas has gone two or three from the field. To the wing right side. Shoots. A prodigy shot is good. Assisted. I tell you what, it's it's almost Number like four. stealing to watch how he plays the game from this scene. So the Kings Second call timeout. They're first. Captain! 
We're about three minutes into this first quarter. Deep two from Stiakovic. Good, and Weber gets the assist. Stiakovic has got five. And I like to see this. They're calling his number early, and he's delivering. It makes sense, right? You're trying to get off to a fast... Oh! <laughs> he's put on a show for these fans. I can't believe he pulled that one out in the course of an actual game. The Kings leading. Tipped away. Robertson with it. And two free throws coming up. Unable to get that one to go with all the contact. And just able to score in so many ways. Robertson puts the defense there in an impossible situation. And that one goes in. Two from the line that time. I'll tell you, he doesn't give points away. Excellent job from the line. Captain Clutch passes to AI. To the right side. And there's Robertson. That's good on the assist by Richmond. Robertson's got his second bucket. Robertson's gone two or three from the floor. Here's the great one. Defended by Stiakovic. Two minutes remaining in the first. Two minutes. 158 left in the first quarter. Here's ABC, and he could not get that one to go. Out of contact, and he'll go to the line for two. That one on Weber. And a moment here to take a look at the scoring breakdown for the Kings. Right now is their passing game, and it's been on point. Doing a great job of moving it around and getting the ball to their shooters. You also have to admire how they challenge the defense inside, getting a lot of points in the paint. DeMarcus Cousins, he's checked in for the Kings. Robertson's gone three for four here from the field. Here's A.I. Pass to the great one. Back to A.I. Looking to end the run. They get it back. Goes back up. And oh boy, a lot of contact there, but he gets the call and will shoot two. It goes on Jerry Lucas. And he makes the first. The prodigy is checked in for the great one. Five. Two shots. That one is no good. Kings leading now by eight. Robertson right side. And Richmond with the stop. Building up a big early lead. They have taken charge of this game. Play calling has been fantastic. They've been a step ahead of the defense since the opening tip. With the shot. A prodigy shot is good. And so here's Sacramento. Robertson outside. Pass to Cousins. To the middle. Here's Lucas. And the rebound by Big Smooth. AI outside. 30 seconds left from the first quarter of the game. Lock at six. Gets the three point of the fall. I'll tell you what, I'm not sure these guys can keep this up. Yeah, both teams in the zone early. Stops have been almost impossible to come by. Robertson outside. And Oscar Robertson with the slam. An inefficient defense there, guys. If there's one thing you want to try and take away from Robertson, it's the dribble drive. Here's the prodigy. And the last shot before the buzzer is off. The the no quarter. shortage of scoring here at the end of the first quarter. 17. It's Sacramento up 7. 24. And the second quarter will be on the way when we come back. If you're just joining us, we've played through one quarter in this one. And when you consider how the Kings are doing, guys, what are your thoughts? Hey, why take jump shots when you can get your points at the rim? Especially at the start. You want to get something positive going and establish your rhythm.
Here's lights out. They've got ABC. Lights out out there with ABC. Then there's the prodigy, and it's garbage man in at the fourth. ABC, and it's Sacramento with the rebound. And for Sacramento, Richmond is out there with Robertson. Then it's Lucas. Then it's Weber. And it's Diakovich in at the three, the small forward. An inviting contact. That's something that Richmond does as well as anybody. Lights out, passes to garbage man. Got a hand on it. And here is Robertson. He's got 11. Over to the left wing. Get there, get there. Mitch, 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 Mitch. Lucas kicks to Richmond. And another three Mitch, for Sacramento. Three. Now that's a high percentage look when the D doesn't fight over the screen. Reason why it takes extra energy to do it. You have to trust your defensive rotations, but it's worth it. And when you're hit, you gotta hit back. And you know he was going to try to respond. Those threes cancel each other out perfectly. And that's how the Sacramento will retain possession. The Beast is checked in for ABC. Second quarter, and we're just over a minute in. And there it is for Richmond. Richmond's got nine. Another good play. This is how they built the lead, calling on the right guys at the right time. The reason why they stayed aggressive and they have not let up this entire night. And at this point, I wouldn't expect them to. Richmond's gone four for four shooting tonight. Here's ABC. The prodigy passes to lights out. Almost, but it rolls out. And so it's Weber with it. He brings it up for the Sacramento Kings. They lead by 11. That's a no-go, and he's still looking for his first bucket after two shots. Here's lights out. Score the Number basket. Four. Nice shot after missing Assist his first from. attempt. Number 10. Here's Archibald. Two minutes now played in the second quarter. The shot from the low post is good. And the Kings lead by 11. Out to the right wing. Here's Garbage Man. And there's a nice one-handed slam. And, and didn't do anything fancy there, but didn't need to. Nope. He, his only concern right now is getting the points on the board. And I, I don't mean style points. Here's Archibald. Right wing. Here's Lucas. Garbage man with the rebound. Lucas has gone two of five from the floor. Here's lights out. All three off the mark. Sacramento leading by nine. Weber looking around. Passes it to Stojakovic. Kings moving the ball around. Six on the shot clock. Off target with his three. And even with good coverage defensively at that time, he has confidence to drill the three. A little undersized at the four, but he can get off the ground. Here's Archibald. Misses the lane. That was excellent contest, preventing him from making something that's usually automatic. Here's the prodigy. Off target from outside. The Prodigy's gone. One of three shooting so far. Archibald passes to Weber. Garbage man with the rebound. Great defensive effort. Just saved a basket. You know what? This is why you never give up on a play. You don't know what's going to happen. You, how can you forget about him? I mean, he's not going to miss that open of a look. For the three. Tips it. He hangs in there and catches it on the second chance points. I love the determination he showed there, getting himself into good position under the glass. With the presence of mind to know just where the rebound was going to come down. Well done. AI has checked in for ABC. And a change for Sacramento. Johnson's checked in. Here's lights out. AI outside. Two minutes remaining in the first half. Two minutes. Here's the prodigy. 
And the pass to AI. Connects from three point range. AI's got six. And just no excuse, guys, for leaving a shooter like him open beyond the arc. Down low, here's Archibald. That's good, and Johnson with the assist. And the Kings lead by five. Attacking the defense with the pass. Don't need to be a hero. Here's the beast, and it's blocked. They retain possession. Here's the prodigy from outside off the mark. And the great shooters know when they've got enough opening to go for the three. I didn't think it was a bad choice Jerry on Lewis. that possession. Yes, Finding sir. a little rhythm here Chris that they well. have to like where they're at. They're playing well. They're building momentum. This is how they can turn a small lead into a big one. Here's AI. Off the mark there with the three-point shot. Sacramento leading by seven. From ten feet out, and it's Johnson. That time on the assist by Weber. Looking to make plays for others. We've seen this from him all night. There has been an emphasis on ball movement, and he's been a major catalyst. Here's the beast, guarded by Weber. Sinks the triple. Lights out. She's got five points now in the quarter. That's a nice read. The value of keeping your eyes up. Six second difference between shot and game clock. To the inside, Johnson. Can't get it to fall. Mm, I'm not sure what happened on that play. May have relaxed a little bit once he got to the rim. Lights out passes to AI. From deep. It's good from long range. Now just a three-point Sacramento lead. Launches it from deep. And the last second attempt doesn't fall. And a close game. It's the 2K Sports Halftime Show. And we hope you enjoyed the... It was a fast pace for Sacramento at the outset. They put together some nice offensive stretches and at one point led by as many as 10. At the end of the first quarter... And that'll do it for our halftime report. Stay tuned for the second... And as we get into this third quarter, as we've seen so far, neither team able to create much separation on the scoreboard yet. Oscar Robertson has been sensational. Yeah, it's been a great performance from him. Really staying focused on quality shots. And many of those quality shots have been jumpers. A very high percentage of those in the first half. Lights out out there with the prodigy. And it's the beast. And it's the beast. And it's the great one in a small forward. That's the group for Mike Fratello getting going here in the second half. Just taking what the defense allows, and that's a shot he'll make all night. Always going up for the alley-oop here. Here's the prodigy. That's the lights out for the lead. Hands it from downtown. Lights out, got eight. You cannot leave him alone like that, especially from long range. To the paint, here's Robertson. Buries the seven-footer. Robertson. Robertson's got the game tied up here for the Kings. He's got the height advantage in that matchup, and he's going to look to exploit it. Lights out, passes to the great one. And he comes Number up with the deuce. He's got nine. Number four. The great one's gotten everything to drop so far. Shooting four of four. Shoots. Here's Weber. That's good. And Robertson with the assist. Robertson's got four assists in the game. Comfortable operating close inside. Weber sizing up the defense there and understands how to finish. The Beast passes to the Beast. Yep, that one goes. And that's an example of playing big, adapting to the situation. And I'm going to give him a lot of credit because he saw what he was up against and he was undeterred. Outsides to Yakovich. 
Kings Oscar DeMarcus Cousins. He's checked in for the Kings. Fox comes in for Stiakovich. Substitution on the court. Here's Captain Clutch, guarded by Fox. The great one passes to the prodigy. Here's the great one. Fires it up. Good for the fifth time in five shots. He remains perfect. And so far in the second half, this has been a different kind of game than what we saw early on. And this half, a more entertaining one. The pace is picked up, tougher defense, better ball movement. Weber, the best to Fox. From deep three-point land, they get the rebound, and it's blocked. And it was not a clean block. Whistle blows and foul on the defender here. It's a shooting foul, so free throws will be coming up. It's his first trip to the line. And he knocks down the first one. We've watched Cousins for a while. I love the way he plays with emotion, but it has to be under control. Wow, wow, he got whacked on that one. Shouldn't be much debate there. First personal foul, first team foul. The first free throw is good. Team number four. That's also good, so he hits both free throws. Now Robertson, he's got 13. On the wing, Richmond. Pulls it up. Releases from the wing and drills it. Assisted. Richmond's got Oscar 11 points. Robinson. He is extremely offensive-minded here tonight. Richmond with the skill set to score on all three levels. Boss, no good. And the pressure he put on that shot forced the miscue. The rim protection at his finest. The result is the same whether you block the shot or simply change it. And generally, Robertson's a guy that likes to play free throw line and below but here's a time where he steps out and launches from beyond trying to get his man back for the last three it helps to not make this personal here's cousins it's rebounded by boss just over three and a half minutes through the third quarter of play now here's captain clutch and he uses the glass on the way they didn't have much of a problem getting the ball into the post that time the Kings trailing. Robertson outside. Two minutes remaining in the third. Two minutes. And foul on the shot. Three He'll three shoot three two and the three free throw line. Second personal foul. These second are his third and fourth free throw attempts of the game. Shooting for Sacramento. Oscar. And good on the second, so he makes them both. 156 left to play here in the third. Pass to Boss. Here's ABC. And the rejection by Cousins. When DeMarcus Cousins is blocking shots, this defense takes on a whole different attitude. To the wing on the left. Releases. Robertson controls the rebound and puts it back up and in. And the Kings lead by three. Let's look at the energy stats, how the hustle game has been going for Sacramento. It's easy for me. Look at their defensive effort all game. The block total shows their commitment to contesting shots. And also, guys, they push the ball and been able to score in transition. Trying to take advantage of playing in the open floor as often as possible. And that's what we're used to him doing. But he really just hasn't had that typical impact offensively if they keep getting him touches this game won't be tied for long there's captain clutch and it's sacramento with the rebound 59 seconds left here in the third quarter not a piece of it and the foul called on abc that is his first foul of the game. Personal foul. I hate to see that. Second I know everyone's foul. mind is on the play, on the floor, but you've got to protect the ball. Mike Bibby. Bibby checked in for Sacramento. Sacramento with the ball. Fires the three. And no good. Three-pointer. ABC's shot is good. ABC's got nine points. 
Yeah, clearly a defensive lapse there. He is automatic from deep if you're going to leave him that wide open. Big time mistake. Now, here is Bibby. Passes it to Robertson. And there's the pass to Embry. That's in, coming off the assist from Robertson. And that pick takes the D totally out of the equation. Hey, if you're not going to fight over, you're essentially giving the shooter the look he wants. Bibby misses. And not allowing the shooter even an inch of breathing room on that one. And you know, we always talk about this. Just changing the shot can be just as effective as blocking it, even though it's less spectacular. Your home team. And we've reached the end of the third quarter. Just a terrific game so far. 58. Up by three. And right after this, we'll bring you the start of the final quarter right here on 2K Sports. to the fourth quarter and what has been a very competitive game should be an exciting finish. The Kings trailed by three on the court right now for the Kings. Lucas is out there with Dibots. Then there's Stojakovic. Then there's Robertson. And it's Bibby in at the point. Great positioning on the putback. Reliable excellence from Divac on the boards, grabbing that one quickly and then taking advantage with the second chance opportunity. It's tipped. And now the fast break. Bibby with the ball. And it's to that. Here's the great one. Pass to the product. from the line and he hits the jump shot if you came to watch a scoring battle you're in the right place yeah both teams trying to close out strong these are the fireworks that fans came to see he was Mike all alone Lee. on that one and that's right in his wheelhouse looking to make an impact when it counts it's the fourth quarter and it's a close game you want to get the ball to someone you can rely on The great one passes to Boss. Robertson with the steal. To the middle to take the lead. Shots good by Stojakovic. And the Kings lead by one. Game winding down, and they just keep changing leads. And guys, no separation yet, and I really don't think we're going to see any all the way down. The great one passes to Boss. Here's the prodigy. And the rebound goes to Divac. And I was sure that was money on that one, but everyone has afforded an easy miss or two. Yes, let's look on the bright side. You got a great look. It's a play that you might want to go back to again. Pass to the Beast. Here's Boss, defended by Divac. Here's Boss, passes to the Prodigy. Sacramento foul. Aston Robertson. Second personal foul. First team foul. And the first one drops. At the Beast is checked in for Boss. Number Richmond is checked in for Sacramento. And that's good as he hits both of his shots. The Kings leading. Here's Robertson. And again at Sacramento converting. He's been locked in all night and he's taking good shots. Fourth quarter of play, and we're about two and a half minutes through it right now. Captain Clutch passes to the great one. That's tipped. Out of bounds. Sacramento will take possession. The ball goes to Sacramento. And it's Lucas with the ball for Sacramento. They've held a 12-point lead earlier. And the call on the shot and sends him to the line. Third personal foul, first team foul. First one falls for. At the line for the Kings, Oscar Robertson. Two shots. That one falls, so he hits both of them. Home team. And the lack of rim protection, top of the list. And it boils down to the question. Toughness. One team showing it, the other allowing itself to be bullied. 
sideline with an update from the sideline. Let's check in with David Aldridge. Guys, Mike Fratello had some advice for his team during that last break. He challenged his team. He said they are not going to give us this one. We have to take it from them, starting now. Let's see if that message resonates. All right, David, thanks. And they have been relentless from deep. And you see the defense trying to react, but to no avail. You know what? They talked about this at halftime, and they're doing a better job of creating space. He gets it in there. And the Kings lead by four. And guys, all about hard work from this point on. They've worked hard to create that high-quality shot and then able to knock it down. It's deflected, and they're able to recover. There's the great one. Drills it from outside. He is just so clutch, saving his best for when the pressure is at its highest. And the Kings with possession. Timeout called by the Kings. All right, fans, get on your feet and make some noise for T-Shirt Time! And now we present our New Balance Player of the Game, Oscar Robertson. And Kevin, it's a no-brainer. He's controlled every aspect of this game, and it's just so fun to see a player perform at a level that's just higher than anyone else out on the floor. Not sure what, what the D was doing there. Clearly a oh, yeah. breakdown. You can ill afford to give a guy like him that good a look. The three, Richmond. Hits it from three-point range. And d Bajin, a cunning passer. Phenomenal at realizing when one of his guys has a clean look. Here's the great one. And it's blocked by Divac. The pass to Lucas. And that one is off. Lucas has gotten three of his eight shots to go, around 37%. Shots good by the Beast. Man, that's about the worst defense I can imagine a team playing coming down the stretch. And I love the play call. This is where you get the ball into the hands of your closers, where they can do something with it. Number four, first personal foul, second team foul. He hits the first one, and that goes to the three-point lead. Oscar Robertson. And he cannot convert on the second. That misses. Captain Clutch passes to the great one. 116 left in the fourth quarter. That doesn't go on the chance to tie. And you know they wanted that one to go down. They could have tied it up. That was a huge opportunity they missed. And what a huge sequence that could be. Wow. A play that might come to define this game. That could be a four to five point turnaround. How quickly things change. It falls. Mitch Rich. Big time basket at a big time moment. This is why we all watch. The NBA is about these moments. Here's the prodigy. Can't tie it up as that one's no good. They'll be trying to take as much time off the clock as they can. Exactly. Expect to see longer possessions from this point on. They get it again. Richmond. Just a physical bull is Richmond. Also, he has the explosiveness to go with the physicality. That's a good recipe for drawing foul. Mitch Richmond. Two shots. It's the first. That gives them a four-point cushion. Sacramento making a switch here. Cousins is checked in, and he hits both free throws here. So now it's a five-point game. Nice job extending the lead and making this a two-possession game now. Here's the great one. Sacramento grabs the miss. They've held a 12-point lead early, and he commits the intentional foul. Fourth team foul. Shooting for Sacramento. Oscar Robinson. He drops the first one, and that increases their lead to six. So he gets them both, and it's a seven-point game. You no know, mistakes there. Good free throws to give them just a little bit more cushion. It's just too big a deficit to come back from at this point. And you know, disappointment starts to set in a little bit. You fought all night, just wasn't meant to be. Now a timeout called by Sacramento. They're leading by four. We've got 22 seconds left in the fourth quarter. We 
We've got 22 seconds left in the fourth quarter. And an intentional okay. foul there stops the clock. That, that's right. No Second other option but foul. to foul and hope for some misses. Foul. So the first one drops, the and that puts the them up by five. Oscar Robertson. Second one is good. And both at the line. And it's a six-point ball game. And so now, a timeout called by head coach Mike Fratello. Guys, what do you think? Uh, they need a quick basket here. Not only do they need a bucket, they need a three just to give them any chance at all. Here's AI. No good on the quick three. Oh, and so they foul. choose to intentionally Number foul. Nine. First personal foul. Team is in the penalty. First free throw is Shoot good, and that ahead. makes it a seven-point lead. At the line for two. Second free throw, no good that time. He really wanted that one. Here's AI. A three-pointer, no good. Robertson with it. So the Kings win it. A narrow win under That's difficult circumstances, Greg, as the visiting team. It really was, but that didn't seem that bomb. To all the fans who made it out tonight. Your support all I know is what makes this they were the better team. Please well said. And that's going to do it tonight, folks, for our broadcast. For Steve Smith, Craig Anthony, and David Aldridge, this is Kevin Harlan thanking you for being with us. So long and good night, everyone.